Hi, I'm Jenny Ladder. I'm the news editor for the Odyssey Media Group. And I'm Sam Madden Parks. I'm a viewpoints writer. And today we are doing Class Athens Best Burger Edition. Woo -hoo. Yeah. Clocked is located in downtown Athens off of Washington Street. It serves specialty burgers, milkshakes, and diner food. All right, Sam, what were your first impressions of Clock like, when we walked in? Yeah, well, it's got that old school diner look with all the movie, old movie posters and an old movie playing on the screen. Yeah, it's very, like, kind of, like, rustic, I feel. Like, it has, like, the very, like, you know, typical downtown hippie look, I feel. Like, yeah, it's just, like, old-fashioned diner stuff. Yeah. What do you think of the menu so far? I thought it looked all pretty good. They have, definitely have a wide range of stuff available, mostly burgers, but other sandwiches and hot dogs yeah. too. And they yeah. have like your standard like cheeseburger, but also like the more like crazy burgers, like the pimento cheeseburger, like the bacon jam burger. They have those options as well, like for people, anyone who wants to try it. But we're taking to something a little bit more typical, like the cheeseburger they offer, which has... Uh, it just has all the normal works and the clock secret sauce. I think the burger actually was like presented rather nicely. Like, yeah, it looked um, awesome. Yeah, it looked really good. The um, bun was nicely toasted. The burger has like a nice char on it. I don't know, it just looks like really fresh and really nice. I actually like want to bite into it, you know? Yeah. I think that's a really good burger. Mm -hmm. For me, the bun is really nice. Yeah. It's like nice and buttery, nice and toasted. It's really good. Also, the way the burger is cooked is kind of unusual, but really good. I don't know. I can't describe it. It just tastes better than a lot of other burgers. But, like, is it worth $7.50, you think? Yes. What do you think? I mean, like, for no fries, I don't know. So, taste. I give it a 5. I don't want to give it, like, a 5 just yet, just because I, I haven't looked at its competitors, but, like, four and a half stars. Like, really good. Preparation. Um, I think I'm like, I think it was made nicely. The char again was really good. So like that's just something like it was like cooked properly. The bun was toasted well. Um, it looked nice. I mean, I don't know. I think it was good. Yeah, so I'd give it like a four and a half, four. Yeah, four, four. and a half. Service. Well, it's not busy here and this And it does get busy. This place gets yeah. swamped sometimes, but right now the service is great. Four and a half. Yeah. Price. I think, again, like, it could be, like, like ever so slightly cheaper because, like, you don't get fries and the drink isn't covered in the price either. But, I mean, the burger is really good again. Yeah. So, like, I think it, like, it I might know, be somewhat worth, worth it. it. Yeah. yeah. So, I'll give, it, I'll give it a four for price. I'll give it a four. Overall quality, I'll give it a 4.5. Yeah, 4.5. It's really good. Yeah. Located in Five Points, local chain Grindhouse opened in 2013. They have burgers, milkshakes, and also have an upstairs bar. So first impressions, this burger I think is like significantly smaller than like the one yeah, at Yeah, I was going to say that, it's kind of small. It's kind of mini, well we did get a junior burger to be fair, but okay. it's still rather small I think for like their kind of, their, like a burger to be served in general I feel. The cheese actually looks really good though, like look at this, it looks, like it's good cheese, you know? And yeah, the, the bun is actually already kind of soggy, I don't really know from what, so we see that. That's a little bit like disheartening, I don't know, but you want to eat it? <laughs> <laughs> It's kind of bland compared to the It's really bland. Yeah. Like, okay, it's like, it has like a soggy <laughs> bun. It's like really wet for some reason. Yeah. Um, yeah, it was dripping on my ankle. The strongest flavor I'm getting is like the pickle, which is kind of surprising. It's like, that, that's just gonna be like the supporting star, you know? There's definitely something uh, missing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like flavor. Okay, so taste. It was, it wasn't really okay. there. Two and a half. Yeah, like a two, Forever. honestly. There seems to be like some seasoning, but like not yeah. really. You couldn't taste the beef at all. Yeah, like Whereas it, with Fox, that was like the main thing. And it was really greasy. It was like really greasy and like wet and like just messy and like yeah. just not really, really fun to eat. Service. I mean, it's not, it's like the, you walk up to the bar and order and then they bring it to you, so. Yeah, so there's like low, oh, there's low interaction between, you know, the customers and like the workers here. I'll give it a four though, because it was super fast. Yeah, yeah, it was really fast, <laughs> so I'll give it, I'll give it a four as well. I got like, it was like, five minutes of us sitting down. It was like the same price like the clocked burger, but like it was a lot smaller, because like, 
not as good. So I feel like it's probably be overpriced for like what we actually get. It's probably over four. This one, it's like a two and a half. Yeah, two and a half. I'll give it that. Um, quality, overall quality. I mean, I feel like it's probably gonna be like a three, like right in the middle of the line, where it's like I've had worse, but I've also had better. That's true. It's not like fast food. Yeah. It's that, but it's okay. I'll, I'll do it. Yeah, a three. Groove Burger is our last stop. Located in Oconee Connector, Groove Burger is founded by Bridger Lofton, who also founded Locos. They serve a variety of salads, burgers, and sandwiches. The atmosphere is pretty cool. The design is really cool. It's kind of spacious. It's got like a nice, yeah. like, rustic but like modern feel to it. I think I could like you know enjoy being here, eating here. Oh yeah. We are getting the Groove Burger, which has thick smoked bacon, Groove sauce, house pickles, caramelized onions, bib lettuce, tomatoes, and a thick slice of extra sharp cheddar cheese. So it's like our other burger, basically, but it has bacon on this instead of like a like, just normal burger, you know. So. I'm set it for, hopefully it'll be good. Blink. The bacon is really good, it's really good. I had reservations and I'm kind of like eating my words here. Taste. I give it a four and a half. I'll give it a four, not as good as clocked, but like better but, than Grindhouse. Yeah, it gets that little bit for the bacon. Presentation, sure, four. Yeah, it looks Solid. nice. Price, well, we kind of discussed that. Price, it's like, yeah, a four also. Yeah, and it's like our priciest it's like burger, the most but like it's it's the biggest burger it's we've had huge. too. Service, well, nobody here, but again, very fast. Yeah, there, really good. there wasn't a host that we had or like a specific server. I think it was fine. No, I just gave it a five. Okay, overall quality, stars. I'd say four stars. I mean, I think Clock was still like had just like that oh, yeah. that bit of edge. I feel, and also it's just like really far out of my way from like where I live and where I go to school, so I probably like, wouldn't come here that often for food. Yeah, yeah but, like, it's in a county. Yeah, so. but like when I do, like I wouldn't mind or like hate eating here. It's pretty, it's a pretty good burger.